tranquilizer, quick! M value 1632? 1637? Please stop soon. Take my hand, breathe, and listen to me. Stay awake. Don't let it take you away. Don't give up. <laughs> it was just a nightmare. It's not real. Wake up. I'm here holding your hand right now, waiting for you to come back. Don't look away, the Chief of Minos. You must understand Mania, the end of sinners. Mania isn't power and mutation. It's an irreversible mental breakdown. Normal humans can't endure an M value above 200. 98.4% of the infected have a mental breakdown and turn into monsters with power, corruptors. But the M values of sinners are at least 600 when they're found. The reason remains unknown. They've endured extreme mutations while retaining their sanity in human form, and even gaining stronger power as a result. But that doesn't mean they don't suffer. Triggers can worsen their mania, which not only brings stronger power, but also deeper fear, sorrow, despair, stubbornness, and madness. Until they can no longer endure it, and break down like any maniacs. The mental contamination caused by maniacs on the verge of breakdown is the most common cause of the spread of mania. The closer they get to the threshold, the more they spread fear and madness, which escalates the disaster. It has nothing to do with the person's willpower or whether the person is a sinner. This is a sign of a breakdown. She's reached her limit. can't. Mania can't be reversed. Besides, someone is monitoring her. I've examined her. Something nasty has been implanted into her body. A remote-controlled capsule with a safety trigger was attached to the outer wall of her heart, which contains liquid mania crystal. The capsule dissolves when a signal is received or someone tries to disable the device. In her current condition, this dose is enough to transform her into a corruptor instantly. She has many old wounds, which suggest she has been abused and domesticated into a weapon. And when she almost died after she attacked you, she had no choice but to crawl to the door of Salva to seek help. Her master doesn't care if she dies. I don't know. Based on past cases, this state can last up to six hours, but she's lasted at least three days. This has happened many times since she arrived at Salva, but she's made it through each time. She doesn't want to turn into a monster. Don't underestimate Salva. This mania isn't a pressure for me and Anne at all. We chose our own path a long time ago. And to your bureau. If you interfere, I'll make you live on a top-notch pair of mechanical arms for the rest of your life. Gotta get to work now. If she wakes up this time, ask her the rest of your questions yourself.
Don't, Chief. Her mania is already out of control. Even you won't be able to take it. She's beyond saving. Please, don't say that. How can we say such discouraging words when the patient hasn't given up yet? In Salva, both the doctors and patients in this hospital believe mania will be cured one day. This kid is no exception. A person who has lost their hope simply can't endure torture like this. Yet she perseveres until now. You must have a place you want to go back to, right? Is there someone you cherish there? You must want to see them very much. Well done. You'll get better. I'll always be here for you. This time, I'll save you. Attack! Those gangsters have returned! <laughs> <laughs>